Radio One Podcast. Podcast. Okay, then let's do it. Oh, what's the kitty? It's play along at home or in the car or on the bus fun. Text me. Let me know how you do. 81199. Oh, what's the kitty? No chappers uh, today. So I've got a feeling you might win this. Well, Zane was meant to do it, but he had to listen to some very important new music until six o'clock, which kind of made. I feel like Steve Blizz, when you cut him open, it says news. You cut Zane low open, if you did, it would say new music. Mm. So. Right, um, let's do it then. Three situations. You just tell me what happened next. Oh, what's the kid in? First one. You know the posh lady off of Radio Four. Yes. She's on. Oh, what's occurring today? Anyway, Is she? Yeah. Here's what she's going to do, okay? We've done this before. You know in films, when someone's got really something very important or a bit embarrassing to say? Yeah. They kind of say it really loud in a public place and everyone just goes quiet and, and starts looking at them. Mm. Happens in films. But does that happen in real life? For instance, let's say I'm in a pub and I just get up and go, it's really busy. Everyone's talking away. I'm leaving you, you cow! And it goes a bit quiet before everyone starts speaking again. But does it actually happen? This is where we test that out with the Posh Radio 4 lady in the pub. So she's chatting to me, okay? Phone to her ear, like she's having a really important conversation. And I tell her quite an embarrassing thing to say. My question to you, Baclar. When the posh Radio 4 lady shouts out the embarrassing phrase in the pub, will the pub go quiet? Simple yes or no question. Mm, no. Here's the posh Radio 4 lady in the pub. So imagine maybe I'm your fiance, yeah? Yeah. Okay, and yes. you're about to drop a bombshell on me. Okay. Okay? Yeah. The phrase is... I'm having an affair with your dad. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah, let's do it now. I'm sort of, let's go. So, hi, how are you? The thing is... The thing what, is... What you Yes? I'm having an affair with your dad! <laughs> <laughs> it's, gone, it's gone quite quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's looking at me now. <laughs> run away, posh radio four lady. Run away, leave your wine and run. I love that. That went properly quiet. Oh my god, I wasn't expecting that. I know. So you're wrong, no points. Oh! What's the kidding? She's up for anything the radio four lady, I love that. <laughs> Question, does the name Michael Barino mean anything to you? Mm, no. Come on, you know Michael Barino. Mm. Surely. No. No? I don't think so. I spoke to him earlier. You mm. don't know who he is, no? No. Right. Tell us what you're the world champion of, please. Well, it's the musical whistling. So what's your official title? Uh, world champion of musical whistling. Love that. Here's the question. We got Michael to call up five Radio 1 listeners at random. And Michael whistled a current pop hit down the phone to them. How many out of five Radio 1 listeners will be able to correctly identify the song that the world whistling champion was whistling? Mm, four. If he's good. Then four out of five. Yeah. Okay. Let's find out. Oh, what's the kid in? Here is the world champion whistler, whistling the hits of today to Radio 1 listeners. Hello. Hello. Oh. Hello? Howdy. Who's that? I'm Michael Barimo. Can I ask you something? Yeah. What, what is this song? Do you know what song this is? Um, you spin my head right round by Flair Rider. Correct. Yay! <laughs> you were able to tell. Figured it out. <laughs> able to identify this tune. 
Why? Is it when we were young, the killers? Sorry. Nope. Uh, not exactly. Ah, uh, no problems. <laughs> Bye. No, no, don't go. <laughs> hey, do you know what song this is? I think it's Kelly Clarkson. Correct. Oh, cool. Got it right. <laughs> Thank you. I ask you something. Yeah. Are you able to identify this tune? Right. Bye. Uh, don't, don't, don't hang up. The answer was two. Two correct guesses. Not four. Oh. Sorry, once again. <laughs> no points. <laughs> What's occurring? I love people's reaction to him. I'm okay, who's this? Hi there, I'm the world champion of musical whistling. My name is Michael Barimo. You're joking. <laughs> <laughs> well, not the Michael Barimo. Sorry, Michael who? I'm Michael Barimo. You know me. A uh, world champion of musical whistling. Oh, that was... Oh my god, I was just like, who? Sorry. <laughs> uh, you know me. Do I? Yeah, you do. Remind me how I know you. <laughs> I'm the whistler. <laughs> right. <laughs> Last one. You know the one that doesn't speak? Yes, very well. Well, he's a big fan of all things Brazilian. Is he? Yeah. I never knew that. Yeah. So we thought this would be a good excuse for our new game on Oh called wa- Oh no. Wax Distraction. <laughs> the one that doesn't speak had 60 seconds to answer as many questions about Brazilian things while being distracted by having an actual Brazilian (laughs) wax. (laughs) So he got waxed. My question to you, how many questions could the one that doesn't speak get right in 60 seconds? I thought they were only for girls. While being waxed. Maybe I'm a bit naive. (laughs) Okay, um... Remember, it's questions about Brazilian things whilst having a Brazilian. Um... (laughs) Uh, two a push. Two. Yeah. Oh my god. Let's <laughs> Please find don't out. show it Let's to find me. out. Oh, what's the kidding? Here's the one that doesn't speak. Getting waxed. Obviously, we've changed the voice on the voice changer. The one that doesn't speak is currently on a stretcher. Um, hi, one that doesn't speak. Hi, Scott. Have you ever done this kind of thing before? Never. Okay. Um, he. Has got his trousers off, and the nice lady here is going to wax you. It's wax distraction. How many questions can you get right while you're being waxed? Okay. Let's find out. <laughs> Does this hurt at all? Hmm? Apparently it's fine. Ah, the wax is coming. What is Giselle Buchanan in the Guinness Book of Records for? Oh, God. <laughs> Going out and in. <laughs> No, she's the world's richest supermodel. <laughs> what is Ronaldinho's nickname in Brazil? <laughs> um, Steve. Gaucho. Uh, what are the colours of the Brazilian flag? <laughs> They're yellow and blue and green. Correct. <laughs> the official language of Brazil is A, Spanish, B, Portuguese, C, Italian, or D, Brazilian. Which river flows through Brazil? Uh, the Amazon. Yes. <laughs> and that is wax distraction. Well done, one that doesn't speak. Thank you, Scott. You now have one bald leg. Oh, Jesus, look at that! <laughs> oh my, thanks for that. <laughs> Okay, so it was just his leg being. Oh, thank God for that! It wasn't a Brazilian, oh. as I said. It's just a good, good excuse to ask questions about Brazil. Uh, the answer was I, I lost count, but the answer was more than two, I think. So, so I've lost. So you've days. lost against yourself on Oh, what's occurring? Let me know how you did. Loads of people on the text loving the Post Radio 